Hi there guys, I thought I'd make a short video on my electric bike that I've built. It's um, based on an English Rally Grifter. Um, I've changed over the bottom bracket for a sealed bottom bracket, which is screwing, and then obviously changed the crank over. Front forks have also been changed, including the headset and the cups. Had to be ground down so I can get a BMX stem on it, handlebars, layback seat so I've recently just bought this motor which is a 36 volt 500 watt I've obviously run the cable up the back there and round and into here where the brain is the small box that plugs into everything concealed behind and then I've got these 3d printed um, battery bases off of eBay uh, they're for storing your batteries really but they suit me down to the ground for what I want to do. So I'm running it off of these 20 volt um, knockoff sort of D-Walt batteries, uh, four amp, and basically they slot down in to there and then it's running series. So I've got another two down the other side. So these two are connected together in series so that gives me 40 just over 40 volts um, but obviously two lots of them so they just click in like that nice and tight I wanted something that was going to hold them in when you're riding around and right now I'll click that one in now and if you look at them on the actual battery itself You've got a B plus and a B minus. Obviously that's your positive and your minus. Again, they click in like that. And you've got your on button. So you can see there, they're fully charged. I took it out yesterday, up and down my hill. Probably did, well you can see, 3.7 miles without pedaling. Um, I have got a pedal assist down the bottom there and then obviously you can adjust your pedal assist by using this button on the bar there up to five which is really quite nice to drive it with the pedal assist and then you've got your miles per hour your distance your temperature if I try and lift it up now which is going to be a bit difficult and get the back wheel spinning there 36 mile an hour under load it's probably doing I think I've got 27 out of it um, but quite easy to wire up I've, I've watched a, obviously a few videos on what to do and just absorb them you know same as what you guys do onto um, YouTube and have a look. The only thing I'm going to do is put a front brake on it. I was slowing down on it. it. It's quite heavy now. I mean, grifter bikes are quite heavy anyway. And that's my custom front light I built for it. Uh, I don't know if you can see the LED in there on. It's glorious sunshine in England. But yeah, that's um, basically it. That runs through there. That's my throttle. That does your adjustment on your pedal assist and turns it on and off if you press the top one you won't see it now but you can illuminate the actual LCD display and uh, turn it around you see the other side of it oh, sorry about that so yeah I'm quite pleased with it all in all it's turned out all right. There's a few little other bits I've got to do. I've got to try and get myself a switch to turn the power off from the batteries. Because at the moment, I know that that gives the power to the brain, but obviously the, the wires that run behind here and come from down here, go inside, link together, and then go onto the power for the, for the box inside. So it is running power to that box. I don't know whether that'll do any harm to it or not, I'm not too sure. 
but I wouldn't mind a nice switch so I can just um, turn it off and then isolate the power. And these batteries, obviously, they just come off. I can use them from a Dewalk drills and they're easy to charge as well. And they've got the little bit on the bottom, gives you the indicator of what charge is in them. So yeah, that's it, all in all. I'm, like I said, I'm, uh, I'm quite pleased with the end result. Okay, cheers guys, bye.